about to declare the open the uh, exhibition called The Coming of Age at the Ace Cafe. <laughs> Well, we're here at the launch of our summer gallery for 2011. It's called The Coming of Age at the Ace Cafe, and it's celebrating the history of the Ace Cafe, which is a fully functional transport cafe and a mecca for bikers, which sits on the North Circular Road, just down the road from Wembley in London. We met uh, the owner of the Ace Cafe, a chap called Mark Wilsmore, who is here this evening. And he, we met him at the, the classic motorbike show and car show at the NEC last November. I was very impressed with our collection of motorcycles that we took. And we got talking between ourselves about putting on an exhibition about the history of the Ace Cafe and what it means to, to motorcyclists, to rockers, to mods, rock and rollers. And, and we found that there was so much history to this cafe that we simply had to recreate the Ace Cafe here and we've brought it to Coventry with the motorbikes, with the tables, the whole interior. We've got a jukebox, we've got pinball machines, we've got a music stage with a live band here tonight. Fantastic. I'm here because I made a movie years ago called The Leather Boys, 1963. It was distributed in 1964, and he used the Ace Cafe very much as a central location. I think people are always nostalgic for their for the era of their teens and twenties, aren't they? You know, but it does have uh, uh, the Ace Cafe and the branding of motorbikes and all that, and of English motorbikes does have um, a very strong and a strong image and a strong memory for people. We're talking about it today. Even now, if on the very rare occasions, if a, like a 250 BSA goes past, his image is like a piece of music to anybody of my age. It's extraordinary. And people often talk about the music of motorbikes. They're a beautiful thing, but it's iconic. It's, it seems to me to be very honest in its intentions. You know, it's, it's, completely, it's completely as it was. And the artifacts that they've brought here, and all the stuff from the Ace Cafe itself, and from the motorbikes in the museum, are authentic. I was determined to see the place reopen. I was determined to see a substantive book produced on the history, or the history of the culture, as it were, of that era. I, I'm also keen to ensure that perhaps a, a, an equivalent TV film documentary is produced and that there would, in the fullness of time, be an exhibition that, that would showcase all that. It's taken a long while to figure out how, how to achieve it, but fortune came to pass where we wound up talking with the guys here at Coventry and, and uh, the opportunity is there for both of us to do something and, and where else could it be that somewhere so appropriate is Coventry, the home of the once home of the British motor industry? 